What is up guys, Quinkin here, and I'm bringing you guys a uh, career mode of uh, uh, Tottenham Spurs, I'm the manager, and um, so let's see how we are in the league table, uh, sorry I couldn't bring uh, episodes before, but I just thought of it doing it now because I, I was having so much fun, but as you guys saw, Spurs are in 4th place with um, 7 points, we uh, won 3 games, or actually we won two games and draw to one and uh, as you can see I made some changes to the squad I traded um, Michael Dawson uh, for Holger Batstuber to Bayern Munich um, I didn't have to pay anything we just switched players and uh, for some reason they thought that was a good trade but it was good for me um, David Alaba we switched uh, Aso Ekoto um, I didn't. I really didn't like that guy. I didn't like the way he looked. I didn't like his stats, and I didn't like how old he was. So I just switched him with Alaba, but I had to pay a premium of nine point five million dollars. But it was worth it. And here we got Polino, which he is actually coming to Tottenham next season. And I had to get him because um, he's a very he's a very good midfielder. He's young, and he's actually going to be in the team next season. Uh, we got Inigo Martinez. Um, I bought him in the uh, transfer uh, deadline. Um, very good player, and I got L Lorenzo and Sine. I got rid of um, uh, Defoe because I, I really didn't like him. He was old, and and Signe is a very young, fast, uh, pacey uh, striker. He's very good. So let's see how we did in the game. It was Spurs versus uh, Queens Park Rangers, and let's see if I could. Uh, get the win today so that I could be in first place in the BPL. So as you can see the game is about to start and here Gareth Bale dribbles a ball around the defender and shoots with his right foot. It's not his um dominate foot that he uses he uses his left foot but it was a pretty good shot had some power behind it and here's a corner Vertagen falls on the floor and he uh, kinda got injured but it was okay. Um I w there weren't that many chances in the first half. The only chance I had was with Gareth Bale. I was very upset because I didn't have any chances. But here, Apollinio passes the ball to Bale. Bale was injured. Uh, he had the medical sign on him. But uh, he scores that beautiful goal. It comes off the post. And um, uh, uh, Bale, like, he, he was on the floor for, uh, I would say, about uh, five minutes in of, of the game. Um and uh, I was scared because I thought he wasn't going to come back. But here, a beautiful pass by Bale. And what a shot by Aaron Lennon just inside the, the outside box. But it was a very good pass by Bale. He got the assist. Um, I, I would say that Bale would be the player of the game. But what a shot by Aaron Lennon. Beautiful shot in the corner. And um, here we win the game 2-0. And I believe that Bale was the player of the game. Um, he played a very good game. He... he he was the one that dominated the ball the most. He had the passes. He, um, I put him in the center forward position so I could put Clinton Dempsey in the left mid because I didn't like the way uh, Dembele was playing, so I had to switch him off. And here was a chance they had. Almost scored me, but Loris gets the clean sheet. And I find out that Bale is going to be out for three weeks because he had a hyperextended knee. Um, that's why he was laying on the floor. I thought he was going to be out in, during the game, but ho but hopefully he stayed and uh, he scored the goal for us. And I'm very I'm very depressed that Bale's going to be out for three weeks. That is um, a lot of games he's going to miss. He's going to miss a, a three in the BPL, and he's going to miss uh, a lot of games in the, the European Championship. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, this was going to be a live commentary like during the game. But I got the audio levels messed up. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Uh, leave a like and uh, comment if you guys enjoyed this. If you guys want me to do um, a com live commentary over the gameplay. Or if you guys just want me to do a commentary like I did today. Um, if I do it like I did today, I think I could get like two, two games in uh, one episode. But if it's live, I'm only going to be going one a game. But uh, I, I like doing it one a game because it, it, it takes the pressure off me. And uh, it's more fun. I could uh, put my uh, more thought into the video and into what I'm going to be saying. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. This has been Quinkin, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.